Oh, welcome back friends uh, in our last class I've just uh, forgot it uh, to say one more thing inside uh, this slide up or slide down or slide toggle we can use uh, this timing you can just uh, give timing here like just like uh, 3000 millisecond uh, is equal to just three second you can just give timing also here save and launch in Chrome So click to hide, uh, this text will hide just in 3 seconds, you can see, sliding up in 3 seconds and slide down, uh, you can just add here also timing, for example 5000 millisecond is equal to 5 seconds, and refresh, click to hide in 3 seconds, click to show, in 5 seconds, you can see. It's just sliding down, sliding up in three seconds, sliding down in just five seconds. You can see. So the same way you can just add here also a timing. For example, we are just adding here four millisecond, four second. Control S and refresh. So you can see, in four second it will slide up and slide down. In four second. So it was about timing that uh, I have just forgot it to tell about this. So in this class, we are going to discuss about some more effects. Uh, so for right now, I'm just going to you remove this timing and remove this timing. Uh, and uh, you can just add here something like slide up, slide down, slide toggle. So instead of slide up, we are just going to use here fat f a d e fat out make sure the o should be kept fed out so just for better understanding uh, i'm just going to remove this and just writing here uh, the effect the effect and just uh, we are going to use some css just copy this control c and inside css uh, we have style tag no style tag so you can just uh, insert a style tag here style tag start and close inside this you can just put a dot sign and effect one you can create just a box for example the width of this box should be uh, 200 pixel the height should be the same 200 pixel and the background uh, color should be something like gray color text color should be white and the font size should be just 27 pixel you can save just come back here and refresh now we have a box here click to hide click to show click uh, to show and hide you can see so we are just going to uh, use here fade out uh, in the first one in the first button you can just say here click to fade out fade out control s now come back here and refresh uh, refresh click click to fade out you can see it is not uh, when you are just clicking on this it is not going to hide it is just uh, going uh, to be invisible you can see if we give a timing here uh, for example fade out uh, in four second control s and refresh just click on this uh, just you can see it is going invisible yes you can see click to show and click to make invisible or you can just right here on the button click to make invisible and you can save this just come back here and refresh so you can see click to make invisible in four second so we are just going to use another attribute this called fade in uh, instead of just uh, slide down so you can just write here fit in so if you want to just give a timing for this so you can give for example two seconds 
control s and come here refresh click to make invisible you can just change the text here also click to make visible control s this is the text on button refresh click to make invisible click to make visible first invisible you can see in four second in two second it is just making visible invisible and visible you can see and uh, on this button you can just try right here click to show uh, just the effect the effects control s and refresh so on this button you are going to use uh, one more effect uh, instead of just uh, slide toggle we are just going to use fade toggle f a d e just remove uh, this slide right here fade toggle control s you can give a timing for example in six or seven second control s and refresh now just click on this you can see it is just going to hide in uh, and it is going to be invisible in six second and it is going to be visible again in six second you can just uh, give another timing for this for example uh, just three seconds is enough control s and refresh now you can see invisible click to show the effect visible so you can see so it was about uh, we can use here a uh, slight uh, we have used here for the first one height slight up and you can just uh, here fade out fade out and for the second one we have used here uh, fade in if should be single fade in and here we have used here fade toggle So we have used uh, effects like height, slide up, uh, fade out. So show, slide down, fade in, and toggle, slide toggle, fade toggle. So in next class we will come back again. We will discuss about uh, some more effects. So till next class again. I'm just saying watch the videos and please do practice. Have a nice time and see you.